Well, their kegs and freezers, they are filled, and now bars and restaurants near American Family Field are preparing for the rush of Brewers fans tomorrow. Aaron Maven joins us live on Blue Mound. It's like Brewers Row right there. They're hoping this playoff will really boost businesses there. Absolutely. Hey there, Ben and Stephanie. A gorgeous day here on Blue Mound, and it has been so fun to talk to businesses. You know, when we usually talk about the playoffs in October, it is cold out. I'm usually bundled up. And as we're talking about Mother Nature, why don't we call today the calm before the storm? Because tomorrow at this time, it is going to be packed with people, and it's going to be great for businesses. At Kelly's Bleachers on Blue Mound. And your salad, anything else I can grab for you? The Monday lunch rush. Is that for here? Is no match for what's to come. You ready for another beer? There's no better days here than, than Brewers games. And then if you make it a Brewers playoff game, you can't top that atmosphere anywhere, in my opinion. Owner Anthony Lucchini says the upcoming Brewers playoff battle will boost business. He says more than the average MLB fan is drawn to the games. It brings out just the Milwaukee and it just wants to be a part of an atmosphere. Down the street. Oh, it's exciting. Dave Greiken and the team at Dugout 54 have stocked up for the playoffs crowds. It's just electric. This whole street it's, feels like Las Vegas, to be honest. Regular season baseball, amazing for Milwaukee. Uh, Postseason, though, even better. Claire Koenig with Visit Milwaukee says the deeper the team goes into the playoffs, the more Milwaukee wins. We estimate that each home postseason game that the Brewers play brings in about $3 million in total economic impact to the community. October isn't always the most popular month for some of these businesses, so the team's run is celebrated. It's a huge increase in our volume when they're in the playoffs. It just adds not only money to the business owners, but also to the area, our bartenders, our servers, our shuttle drivers, uh, even our parking lot guy makes more money on playoffs. And while the workers keep up with the orders, they'll also be watching the brew crew in action. The team is so intimate, you can tell. Like, I think they got a really good shot at this. So what type of team do you want to play to make the most money? Obviously, you want a team that's within driving distance. So think uh, the teams from Illinois, uh, uh, Chicago area, the Cubs. You can just drive on up so those fans fill these businesses. The next best thing is one with a direct flight. That is Phoenix. There's a direct flight from Phoenix to Milwaukee. So it is possible that we could see a number of Diamondback fans here in Milwaukee tomorrow, hopefully stopping at restaurants and bars and really boosting our economy as we beat their team. Reporting live on Blue Mound, Aaron Maven, Fox 6 News. Got to call you out, though. You just said that they want uh, Cubs fans to come here. I'm sure a lot of Brewers fans are very <laughs> happy the Cubs did no, not make listen it. listen to this. Let's <laughs> Listen to this. When I talked to Visit Milwaukee, she said, I hate to say this, but it's not bad when the, Cub, when the Cubs come up to Milwaukee because they definitely see an increase in revenue. So That's because they're thinking about passing, money and just, not the, the heart, Aaron. Yeah. They're getting greedy with now. We'll take the dollar bills. All right, should be fun That's this right. week. Thanks, Aaron.